Hey, it's the Tara from Pretty Hair is Fun, and it's that time of year again, and we have a super cute homecoming hairstyle that we think you'll love. Let's get started. Okay, she's got a side part, you can see, so I'm just gonna part from the back of that part, the crown of her head, down to just behind her ear. I'm gonna do a really stretched Dutch braid right up here that's close to her face. So I'm just going to start right down here in this corner. Then I'm going to pull all my hair down to where I'm doing this braid just close to her face so that it can be seen more from the front. Okay, and then once I get right here to where about where her ear is. I'm going to pull out, leave out a few of these little hairs so she can have some curls in the front. And then I'm going to start angling it back to behind her ear. And by now I've pulled in all the hair that I've parted off. So I'm just going to finish this braid off few more inches. Before I put in an elastic, I'm going to come up and just stretch this. I'm just going to slip in an elastic for now. And I'm going to do the other side and we're going to put in two twist braids on this side. Okay, so I just parted this off the same way I did on the other side. Now I'm just going to split this into two halves like this. Split it down the middle again. I'm just going to make this a twist braid. So I twist in one direction and then I wrap to the next or to the other side. So I'm twisting to the left and wrapping it to the right. And then I'm going to come in and just pull this wide as well. Okay, and I'm just gonna put on a little elastic. Same thing, it's just gotta reach to the back. You can leave these in. For the last part, you can take out the elastics at the end. Okay, and then this bottom section, I'm just gonna do the very same thing. Okay, now that we've got the sides and the front done, we're gonna go around to the back. Okay, we're gonna be pulling all this into a low bun, so we want some volume up here. So I've already parted off a section, and I'm just gonna tease it a little bit with my teasing brush. And I'm gonna give a little bit of hairspray. Flip it over and let it dry. And 
Let's do that for a few more sections. Let's let that dry for a few seconds. Okay. Okay. Okay, now that I've got the top rounded and we're how I like it, I'm just gonna come underneath with my finger and just come straight up in the middle and just separate the hair in the back into two halves. But you don't want your part to show up here, just from about here down. So it should show. I'm just going to gather this in a low pony and I'm going to bring her braid on this side in. Like that. I'm going to take an elastic. I'm going to pull this into a half pulled ponytail. Last pull through. I'm going to angle it so I'm coming and pulling down. I'm only going to pull it about halfway, like that. And then we're going to pin this up. Now I'm do the same thing on the other side. Okay. Now this is where if you want you can slip out these other elastics so they don't show. Okay, and then just come back in and kind of pull that up a little bit. And you might a little flattened. So the two ponytails gives the bun a little more width. It makes it look a little larger. So now just grab some bobby pins. And you're just going, going to um, really play with it and just pin how you want it. So I'm going to, I want this to go in a little bit more, so I'm just going to kind of flatten these loops out and just come in and try and grab some of those and pin it up to her head a little more. If your hair is really slippery like Satara's, one trick we've learned is to take your bobby pin and spray it with a little bit of hairspray on both sides and it really stays in nice, especially for updos like this where you really need them to stay. Okay, now I'm just going to put in a few of these little twist pins. I love these for fancy occasions. They just twist in. I'm going to put a few just up here across the top. Okay, and she is finished. I hope you enjoyed this homecoming hairstyle. For more like it, make sure to check out this playlist. Make sure to subscribe and give us a thumbs up and I'll see you next time. Bye.